Under the guise and concepts of love and loyalty, we recognize across America and throughout history and time that there have been this sort of three areas of sexuality. Typically in America and typically in social circles, we do not talk much about sexuality. We may talk occasionally or joke occasionally about sex, but we only really talk about those topics with the most intimate of relationships and life partners. Those life partners might be actual sex partners, or those life partners might actually be just people that we know so well and are so close friends that we are willing to talk about those typically publicly taboo topics. When I talk about this with you, I'm communicating to you that people do talk about these topics even with business colleagues like I have done once or twice with people who told me a story of what was going on in their family if I was serving their child and they needed some help from me on something so that they could make some telephone calls on my home phone line to get some information to protect themselves from an abusive husband. Or perhaps they needed to talk to me about their feelings about needing a girl's night out and I highly encourage them not to do it not because they didn't have the right to do it but because of the fact that any photographs or any audio clips taken of them enjoying themselves with underlings as a superior person in leadership to subordinate people in teamship might not go well for the overall practice of the business and that's something that does sometimes happen across corporate culture and core worker life when we have kind of bridesmaid parties and other sort of things and we've certainly seen uh, things like runaway bride but also we have these marvelous scenes not or not that it's important with Kira said we're kind of setting Julia Roberts straight on a lot of things in time what I can tell you is that in life people have life partners that are a part of their family of choice they are their friends they are their colleagues they are their co-workers they are from philanthropic organizations they are from their businesses they are from their corporations but what we're talking about in truth of love and loyalty is how we behave with the information of confidentiality under the guise and the topics that are sort of taboo in public and in prof professional settings of sexuality.